Howdy, y'all. These are two brand new, recently released Atherin Genesis GP38s in Florida East Coast schemes. Um, they're both equipped from the factory with Soundtrack Tsunami 2s. Now, these come out of the box loud and fast, and that's pretty much the opposite of what I'll be using them for. So I've started to tweak the factory settings, and I'm no expert at this, but I'll go through some of the changes that I've made to make it sound more scale and uh, operate more scale as well to me. So for this demonstration, I'm just going to be using the throttle and the change of direction button, and all other sounds you hear will be just the um, program running its course. First up was CV3. I have that set probably somewhere uh, between 200 and 250 for either one of these. Um, I want to hit the throttle and just hear a bunch of noise and not have it go anywhere. So you'll see it's a, it's slow, but that's how I want it. CV4 is probably set at about 75, and that's coast and break. CV123, 124, and 125 are all set differently for both of these. So the prime mover, the air compressor, and the poppet um, I changed just so I can kind of start dialing in exactly how I want both of them to operate sound. All right, the primary mixer sounds um, 150 to 160, all those things I turn off. I try to turn off as many things as I can to set up. I want to hear the, the thing run, basically. I want to hear engine and, and mechanical stuff first before I add anything else. Um, so that's kind of where I, where I start. Um, and I also crank everything way down, most of the sounds are under 50 so it's I I mean I have a shelf layout it's eight foot long by you know the foot and a half deep um, the sound is very powerful so I crank everything way down now this will be uh, 501 so again the prime mover is a little bit different the uh, compressor is different and I have the fans, I, I turn on the fans up a little bit because whenever I'm close to a EMD locomotive like this and it's just going by slowly, it's kind of whirs and hums. I hear more clanking and banging from the wheels than I actually do locomotive. So that's what I'm trying to recreate. Again, this is different sound of a prime mover, so a little bit of a different effect from 509. So I really like the Tsunami EQ, the equalizer. You can mix the reverb and feedback, and um, it's it's pretty neat. I haven't really tuned it on these two, but I did. I have an Anthrogenesis GP9, 
and I, I played with that extensively, and it was it was pretty cool. I, I really like that feature. So eventually I'll get to that as well. Right now I was just more concerned about running and, and hearing it run. So now I'm, I've got both of them. I'm going to put them next to each other. Just to hear them both together. So I was really happy that Atherin Genesis put the um, the lights like that for these two FEC units because that's how I remember them before they went to ditch lights. I thought that was a neat feature. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed that. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. I'll do my best. I'm no expert. I'm still learning this stuff. But anyway, thank you. Bye.